The Mouse in the Hammock, A Valentine's Tale by Bethany Brevard. It happens this time every winter. I slowly wake up in my cozy, warm hammock, stretch my body, and jump out of bed. I scurry to the window and I look outside. The sun is shining, the snow is melting, flowers are blooming. Everything looks lovely. I see two doves hugging. I see two squirrels dancing. And I see two children holding hands. I can feel it. Love is in the air. And this can only mean one thing. Valentine's Day is near. That's a busy time for a little mouse like me. That's when I get to show my friends just how much I love them. On Valentine's Day, people give each other presents, cards, or chocolates. Or all three if they really, really like you. But I have none of these things. How can someone little like me show how big my heart is? I'll have to get creative. So I scurry around the house looking for all of the little things that show I care. The children's room is always a good place to start. On the first day of February, I find a piece of scrap paper. Hmm, what can I do with this, I wonder? I know, and I neatly fold it into an airplane. You make my heart soar. On the second day of February, I find a bear cookie. Hmm, what can I do with this, I wonder? I know, and I lay it on the table. You're the very best. On the third day of February, I find a toy frog. Hmm, what can I do with this, I wonder? I know, and I tie my card to the frog. You're totally awesome. On the fourth day of February, I find a little toy car. Hmm, what can I do with this? I wonder. I know, and I skid it across a piece of paper. You're really cool. On the fifth day of February, I find an old stuffed monkey. Hmm, what can I do with this, I wonder? I know, and I attach it to monkey's toe. I like hanging with you. With each passing day, I use all the little things I find to show my friends my love for them, and I leave them around the house for them to discover. From a rocket to a dinosaur, from marbles to googly eyes. Every morning, I can hear them squealing in delight as they find my little gifts. And this makes me happy, very happy. For every smile, every laugh, every shriek of delight makes my heart feel bigger and bigger. Finally, Valentine's Day arrives. I run around the house looking for one last token to give to my friends. But something else catches my eye. The glow of a golden heart. This is for you. Thank you, says the note. I hug the golden heart. What a great gift. How could I ever top it? I know. No little gifts this time. No notes. No candies. Just me. Because being there for my friends is the greatest gift I could ever give them. The best way to make friends is to simply be friendly. Little acts of friendship make a big difference. Thanks for listening to The Mouse in the Hammock, A Valentine's Tale. Make sure to click that subscribe button and thumbs up so you can listen to more videos like this.